The South Korean government aims to develop more tech talent. By 2026, officials have the ambitious goal of nurturing a million prodigies in the digital sector. Here's our final episode of Digital Korea series by our Shin ye -eun. Using AI, flying drones, operating robots, these are the basic things taught at this elementary school. Unlike other elementary schools, we learn how to program software and handle AI. I personally like programming. I entered myself into programming competitions. This shocked many because I was one of the youngest contestants. Located in a small county in Gyeongsangnam-do province, Ani Elementary School adapted an AI curriculum in 2016, aiming to raise its students' digital literacy. As of now, there are some 560 other elementary schools like this one, all aiming to teach AI and software programming as regular subjects by 2025. Our students perform much better in computer or IT classes when they entered middle school compared to other elementary school graduates. That's because they're familiar with AI and programming. First and second graders play with robots during recess. Third graders learn how to make games using software. We make sure AI is part of their daily routine. Though it may be best to learn how to use AI, robots and software from a young age, it's never too late to become a digital prodigy. Here at the Innovation Academy, even adults can learn how to become more tech savvy. How? With no set textbooks, no professors, no expensive tuition fees, and no graduate degrees. It's called 42 Soul. Back in 2019, the Ministry of Science and ICT created the school, using the world's first computer science academy of this kind, 42 in Paris, as a benchmark. Here, students learn from each other. They graduate only after two years of projects that get harder and harder. I enrolled in this academy because I want to become a developer. Nowadays, companies aim to recruit developers with high skill sets and practical experience rather than prestigious university degrees. I think 42 Seoul read this trend perfectly. Its innovative educational programs like this can create candidates who will land jobs in digital companies. South Korea hopes to change up the country's education methods so that more students are comfortable with new tech, like AI and the metaverse. In the next five years, more schools will have software education, AR and VR, at the core of their curriculum. Shin Yeun, Arirang News.